So the other day a girlfriend of mine was over and I set up a painting project for her daughter and and my son and I thought I, I was telling her about about this little trick of mine that I've discovered. So basically if you have like this you know acrylic paint or whatever and you want to get rid of it because you know you do use this stuff for projects and then you're left with a bunch of it the it, it stays in clothes like it, it gets on things but if you add some shaving cream to it not only does it make it like puffy paint but it also comes off of like clothes and surfaces a bazillion times easier so I'm just gonna mix this together really quick here it is you know all mixed together and I'm gonna do the same thing with green and then we're gonna paint and show you some fun painting tricks and tips I've learned with all these kids one of the girls I watch her mom's friend had given away some apples they're all pretty um, pretty like gross in a way so the reason I'm using apples for this is because they're kind of here's you know they're, they're kind of gross so I don't want to use you know I'm not gonna necessarily feed these to the kids I mean, I guess I could get creative with cutting them off, but we're using them as a project. We're cutting little slits in them so that there's kind of like a, a handle. And then I'm going to show you my table saving, although there's not much left to save, but a table saving technique. So a few little tips here. This paper right here is from the dollar store. You get 30 sheets for a dollar. It's not the best, but it works great. See, it holds up. And this right here is a twin sheet. I put it on my table to kind of just help preserve it, but more or less just keep it clean. It is an old one, and there is a hole in it, and it's just not, you know, super functional. So, anyhow. Will you wash it? Is that fun? Wash it, Mommy. Do you want to eat an apple? Yeah. I'll get you an apple to eat, I too, okay? Eat that. I <laughs> eat that. I eat that. Okay, one. okay, I'll get you one to eat. These ones are for painting, though. All right, anyways, there's some, uh, some fun fall projects and a few little tips. Bye, guys.